Welcome back. Let's go look at a snowblower. All right. I know what you're thinking. Single stage snowblower. That's not a real snowblower. I'm here to tell you this is the best one I've used. I've used lots of two stage, they work good. But what you really need is a single stage. It's so much easier to use and man these things throw a lot of snow. They're not as cool as a two stage, I agree. But if you, if you want to throw snow, you want to do it easy, maneuverable, light. One guy, I can lift this in the back of my truck, no problem. Um, with a two stage, it, uh, loading a, a snowblower with two people is a lot of work. So, I'm just going to go over some of the things I've changed to this. Uh, I know it doesn't look like a lot of snow around. I, I live in the part of the world where you get a Chinook. It, it's February out and I mean this is it. It's like plus 12 degrees Celsius. So there's more snow coming. But this is, if you're wondering, <clears throat> February, Canada, Alberta, this is a Chinook. It's all the snow I have left in my yard. So uh, this snowblower is, I don't know how to date it. Um, if I look at the manufacturing tag, I doubt if it's going to focus. It is made in United States. So that tells you how old it is. Late 80s, maybe 90s. So two stroke takes mixed fuel. You gotta mix oil and gas together. Uh, that's a disadvantage, but the advantage is there's no maintenance to it. You don't have to worry about oil, changing oil, oil getting old. Um, it is loud because it's old and you know the, the it's definitely the loudness is an issue but I'm sure the newer ones are going to be a lot quieter this, this muffler is probably blown out uh, this was given to me free wasn't running all it took was clean out the carburetor it was really gummed up maybe set the float a little and it was good Working on this is a little tough. You, you have to take off this bottom uh, clamshell and uh, loosen up the handle, take off the control panel. So, it, you know, it's going to take 15 to 20 minutes to get at the carburetor if you ever need to get at the carburetor. And uh, that might be an issue for some people. But, I, I mean, two stroke. Put it in your mixed fuel, you're good to go. So there's not much to say. You probably want to see this thing in action. The snow is super sticky. As I said, it's warm out. If you're gonna see, this is probably worse conditions for this kind of a snow blower. I, I'm not even 100% confident it's gonna blow snow that far, but uh, we'll set you up and we'll see how it works. Should we do this one take? We'll see how successful we are. How's it been run today? Key on, mine has a primer. Choke.
fairly certain I ran out of gas. I only had a splash in there because I was cleaning the carburetor, but uh, working good. Mods I made, little bit bigger tires, wheels I guess. They're a bit bigger. And I put some foam on here. It vibrates pretty good. So the foam, it just makes it a little more comfortable. And that's it. It was throwing it over the fence, which again, wet, heavy snow, pretty exceptional. And you can see like back and forth, just how quick you can do it. Anyway, thanks for watching.